Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So in today's video I'm going to show you, the best build for Buddha users. And before that, make sure to like and subscribe. So let's start. First, there are accessories. Well, there are indeed a lot of accessories in Black's Fruits, but it's not certain that these accessories will be useful for Buddha users. The first accessory is a hunter cape. You can get it through Elite Pirates, which has a 50% drop chance. You can get it super easily. And secondly there is a Gal Mask. You can exchange these accessories from the El Perro NPC who is on the Cursed Ship. Second C. This accessory has 10% life leech, 2.5% against NPCs. 35% speed, 500 energy. The life leech ability of this accessory will be very useful for Buddha users, so I really recommend it. Next there is fighting style. This game also provides various fighting styles from low tier to high tier. But, for Buddha users, Electric Claw is a very good fighting style to use. That's because the Electric Claw has a fast M1, good for grinding, you can use it for raids, raid bosses etc. You can also use the Electric Claw for PvP. And then there is Sharkman Karate. I think many people already know this, because this fighting style has a faster M1 compared to all existing fighting styles. And you can also use it for grinding, raiding, raid bosses etc. And then there is swords. And the only sword that is the most overpowered and unstoppable is CDK. Cursed Dual Katana is a mythical type sword, and also one of the swords that is very difficult to get. This sword has several advantages such as fast attack, very high damage, great mobility and great range which is very good for Buddha users. I don't think I need to explain why this sword is so overpowered, but if you are a Buddha user then CDK is the most recommended sword for you. And finally there are aces and stats. For ace, I really recommend you use Gal race. I recommend it not without reason. Gal is the best combination with this build. By using the life leech from this race and the Gal mask accessory, the life leech ability will increase. This will be a deadly combo for Buddha users. And then there are stats. If you follow the build in this video, then the best build is 2450, maximum, melee 2450, maximum, defense, 2450, maximum, swords. By maximizing melee and sword you can maximize the potential of the life leech ability from race, accessories and cursed dual katana. So that's all. What do you think, if you have your own build? Let me know in the comments. Oh, 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 oh,